Good morning friends. Today is 7th September 2023, Thursday 22nd week in ordinary time. The universal call to holiness. Paul teaches that holiness is gained by the normal activities of daily life if done in a spirit of faith and trusting in the grace of God. The normal natural activities of life, employment, study, health care, eating and drinking, family life can be dedicated to God as be and be performed with gratitude. Paul's ideal for us as for his original readers is to lead lives worthy of the Lord fully pleasing to him. This universal call to holiness is shared by all the baptized. It is a blessing to know that the Lord has useful work for each of us to do. What we need is the courage and insight to know where to cast our nets. Most of us must have tasted failure in one shape or form. We may have failed to live up to the goals we had set ourselves. Some enterprises or some initiative that we have invested in, in may have come to nothing. All such experiences can leave us feeling disheartened. There, there is a response to the feeling of failure in today's gospel passage. <coughs> we can hear the note of failure in Peter's complaint, we worked hard all night long and caught nothing. And in his later appeal, leave me Lord for I am a sinful man. Failure does not need to have uh, the last word because the Lord is near and can help us through them. He transformed the apostles' fruitless night, night's labor by giving them an abundant catch of fish. He also insisted that the sinful Peter would work with him drawing people into the nets of God's kingdom. The Lord is constantly at work in all kinds of unpromising situations, bringing life out of loss and failure. For this to happen, we need to not give, a, give it into dis discouragement. We need to keep putting out into deep waters in response to, to, to Jesus' faithful word. God bless us all today.